Hello, my lovely Virgo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Welcome to your daily read. Let's see here today what we got for you. This reading is for November 26th and the 27th. We just got in new moon. We're getting a new moon as I'm recording a day before. Virgos will do um, an advice for you from the Gilded Reverie Lenormand also will do your reading as we used to. We'll get your energy, we'll get the spirit messages. Also, welcome everybody here. Okay, loves, we have a new beginning here with the child. Also, it's something for your own stability. Okay, because one plus three is four, and four is about stability. It is a new beginning. For some of you, you might go study again. For some of you, you might feel like a new life, a new journey. Definitely something is going to start or it's something starting again better from the scratch. Let's see here what this is about and what the spirit want to give to me when I spirit want to share with you loves spirit give me some insights for the Virgos who are here who come in here who needs to hear these messages guidance for the Virgos also everybody is welcomed even the cross watchers welcome to the channel let's see here loves we'll get three cards of your overall energy we have High Priestess, Water Sign. Something is over and you do know it for sure. You're walking from a situation from somebody very secret, secretive, secretive. But I feel here you, you left somebody behind. I don't feel you talking with them. For some of you are traveling because we have two travel cars towards somebody you do love. For some of you, you're going to meet somebody somebody who you really care and cherish. I don't feel you talking with that person right now. But I feel here for many of you, you end a chapter into your life and you feel like now is the time for me to move forward. This is you, loves, Eight of Cups. Was something you've been dealing quite a bit for, could be two years, because High Priestess, they are two years. But what I'm feeling here, like, it is a situation you couldn't even tell anybody what you're going through. And I definitely see you and feel you, Virgo. Let's hear what this is about. I feel here you are aiming for new beginnings here. Here you are, loves. You've been deeply reflecting very much. For some of you, you're very much connected over these past years, past months, with your entities, with your angels. For many of you, you've, you've gone through an awakening here, very much into spirituality here. Out of that, we have three major arcanas here, Virgo. Ace of Wands, I feel here I'm, I'm putting cards on the upside down. You very much were thinking of having something new, something refreshed. But kind of like, I'm holding back. For some of you, is a money situation was bothering you for quite a bit here. It might be connected with the Sag. I see Pisces, could be a fellow Virgo. This person is very much thinking of you. Free person. But I feel here, you might be in the past with them. But I feel here, they feel it's done and over. I I also get the energy, they are still thinking of you, but they feel like this is done and over, because you are too much into no way, very quiet, sun, Leo energy, five of cups, could be, uh, could be in the past, a leap of faith, but I don't feel didn't go. 
or start something in the past but didn't go further or didn't go for more I feel here right now somebody does regrets why this happened how this happened and I definitely see here healing for some of you Virgos you do absolutely love this person okay and they do love you because I feel here could be a new beginning here because we have Sun which is about new beginnings for some of you you would like to have a new beginning with this person and forgive or forget what was in the past but I don't feel you talking right now with this person I feel here you might connect with each other through spirituality telepathically to say that one of you didn't feel like this will go also some some of you Virgos you might deal with somebody could be in and out and they ended this connection because I feel here this person being focused on other things that's why they could probably not committed to you or something was in between neither of you could be at one level or something like that for a part of you Virgo what I'm gathering here there is regrets regards children or regards a child or why didn't get why we could not we did start and we ended at the same point so it's basically something didn't go further between you and this person and definitely what I'm picking up it's twin flame energy here Virgos I feel here for many of you you have regrets how this gun or how was between you two this person very much thinks of you too Virgos somebody really wants a new beginning fresh start here let's see here why this four of pentacles for some of you was money an issue for some of you one of you could be in a commitment with somebody but with the high priestess here there was a lot of things not revealed not spoken was not a give and take was not a open thing but I feel here it is an opportunity here if both of you or one of you could forgive because we never forget could forgive what was in the past this could work but I feel here it is a lot of healing needed in this situation for this relationship to pick up and go further absolutely yes definitely past life situation and I feel here for for some of you Virgos you want to take this leap of faith because you realize so many things over this time but it's kind of like I'm not ready or I don't see how to do it or I don't know how to do it I feel here you'll be surprised here for some of you you're dealing with a Gemini or with a fire sign for some of you is a Pisces or a Scorpio but I feel here was a choice to leave something behind and to go further for some of you something changed radically into your life to realize so many things and that's most likely about love All right, let's have some clarifications here. Why this Four of Pentacles? Why was so much hold back here? Nine of Cups. You felt like if you will reveal everything what you want, this person will never love to you. It was like you, you hold your happiness just for you and not revealed. For some of you, you might feel like I was not enough even I really want this person for some of you you had so many obligations money obligations or you feel like I don't make enough and this person will never love me 
And believe it or not, Virgo, I don't feel this was something this person cared about money or vice versa. Why this person is thinking of you? Why this Nine of Swords? Chariot? Cancer energy? They, they might want to try to come back to you, travel towards you. It is some trouble here. Either you, either them. Hierophant. They might feel right now, or they felt at that time, to move into stability with you, and they didn't feel like you will give them what they want. Other storyline, other message, what I get here, one of you, either this person been in a commitment with somebody here and they, they've they been focused on those things and not necessary on you. They could be in and out of your life just because of that. Ten of Wands. Hangman. King of Cups. One of you needed to end or have in your life a water sign. And that was stuck. That relationship was stuck. It was like going forward, stuck. Going forward, stuck. Either you, Virgo, either them. Let's see. Five of Cups. Queen of Swords. This person really wants to talk to you, loves. And definitely here was a third party involved. So Virgo, who was involved in a third party? You or the other person? But I feel here... You you really want to tell this person we could have this relationship. One of you didn't allow it. One of you've been very confused. And I feel here you, Virgo, have been very confused. But definitely was a third party here. We have Queen of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, which is you, and we have King of Cups. So definitely here was somebody else. And I feel here you, either this person was in a commitment, either you, one of you for sure. And this didn't work because it was somebody else. This person gave you so many mixed emotion signals. I definitely see you healing, Virgo. But I feel here also you will hear from this person. You will hear from this person even unexpectedly here. Okay. It is definitely here a fire sign. For some of you is an air sign and water. Very heavy energy here. Very complicated situation here for you Virgo. But definitely somebody here, it is traveling over this time. Strongly is a travel for some of you, Virgos. You basically change your home. Okay? And why I'm saying that, you are going to move across the world or across the city or in a very different, a very different city than where you are. Okay, and I feel here you choose it that to go. Okay, you choose those, that thing. So, loves, this is what I got here. And thank you for watching and being here on the channel. Many blessings to all of you. And I will see you next time. Bye for now.